Hey guys, sorry about that. I having a problem with the connection here. Oh, where's buddy? My controls weren't working. They weren't responding correctly in that, and I don't know what the heck to put going on. It's working now. Technical problems. So, before this whole damn mess, I managed to get two fish I, at the same cast, so they're a biting. Now that's. So, we're on the hunt for a trophy char. Why? Well, I want to find that blue fish he found. Took him seven hours. I, I, I'll do seven hours, but uh, I don't know. Nah, did you see? You have to, you have to be from South Africa to be able to put that eight hours into a damn game to catch a small tiny blue fish. <laughs> Perseverance and patience, bro. Nice dragon. Okay. <laughs> I gotta look That's at the right like side, the, so. you, you almost looked at like a red one, but it wasn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What lure was that lure? Quaker 001. Nice. Yeah, DPI, yeah, I even got an achievement. Staying in one spot fishing for over seven hours without any interruption. Did you? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just shot of everything. Okay. Well, you can stand your ass and not move. Make sure you stay here. The achievement is more like a like a command. The, the, the thing is like uh, get back to the family with like uh, exclamation marks so that like you can play with your logging stuff and you can go. Ooh, another one, it's a bit smaller, 857. Oh my dog, this one quit. Just gotta have a problem today, it's steady. Get him like a chew boy or a cat or something to play with. Oh, he, hey, he found a chew toy yesterday, it's gone, my blind. <laughs> yeah, my that's, that's, that's a bad chew toy. Yeah, go to the foul, find a small cap. You know, not too small that it gets stuck in his throat, but you know, a small cap. And you'll be able to play with the cat. He likes way. cats, it, it, but he don't like the cats that's outside. He's got yeah, stray yeah. cats everywhere, and that's what he's growling at. You just need to catch those cats and feed them to the dog. I don't think he'll eat them, I think he'll lick them to death. <laughs> Either way, so this is not far to get this. What dog is it? He's a flat home picture. I posted a picture a few days ago. Should yeah, still be there somewhere. Oh yeah, I saw I saw it, I saw it. Alright, every time he's actually peaceful when he's sleeping. I've got two monster dogs at home here. Uh -huh. Two Yorkshire Terriers. Yeah, I've got two Jack Russells. Uh, they take good care of the snakes around here. Yeah, on the on that that farm I sent you guys to check on um, Facebook, he's got the worm has I think seven Jack Russells. Yeah, that's one of mine. She catch on average about 15, 16 snakes every year. The only yeah, ones I don't let her catch is the, the Bofaras, but the other ones, the Cobras, she sorts them out. Yeah, my dog was playing the damn snake here in the first, uh, um, when it was one year old, sitting there chasing around the backyard with some damn freaking uh, weird snake that no one plays or anything. And uh, he sat there, kept playing with it, grabbing it, playing with it, grabbing it, and all of a sudden the snake turned around and just 
bit him right in the neck. That was the last time he played with it. <laughs> we actually, we lived on a small holding in South Africa just outside of Nailstrom. And one day me and my sister, we had a really big yard. We had a yard around our house was probably 200 meters around um, each side. And so, um, me and my sister were playing in the yard and a black mamba came up mm. and confronted us. And one of the female boxer we had was with us and she got in between, killed it. But what we didn't know at the time is the snake got her on the lip and then she disappeared. We couldn't find her for around three days. Mm. And then, um, we found her in a bush. Like, she looked like she had inhaled helium. She was, like, puffed up and everything, but she saved my sister's life. It's just really sad that we didn't know that she was bitten. Yeah, uh, luckily uh, we don't have mambas here by me. The only poison snake we have uh, around us is called the, uh, timber, the timber rattler. It's not as potent as the rattlesnake, but... It still can hurt you. There's something here called a daisy. Uh, it's a uh, nosing pits for things to go around. Those fucking things are nasty. Yeah. That's the one thing I'm glad we don't have here either because they mess up a dog. Oh, yeah. Because it's further than the eyes here. They do manage to nail it. That dog's done. Or you can do whatever the fuck you want to do. Not so much. Did we add. We had. When I was very, very young, we had two bull mastiffs, a burbul. Um, and one day, one. Okay, guys. Um, so I'm here at Sura River. Um, we're at this location of 8:59:45. Um, casting in this deep hole right here. The reason why for that is that if you stay here, you're bound to find a lot of roaches, but not only that, you can find a lot of roaches too. What I mean by that, um, let me show you so you guys can know that this is true. Um, right in this, I took a screenshot of this. Um, so go into my documents here um, Russian Christian 4 screenshot right here See right here, I got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's nine trophies here. Um, I caught that within an hour. <coughs> Anyways, I'm using um, the mayfly larva and. Also got to using the roach mix here. Those are very important to use. I have one rod that don't have it, so I gotta fix this one up. I try to make my own bait, but that did not work very well, so I'm sticking with these. If you guys gonna fish here, um, yeah, come to 59.45 and sir, grab some um, mayfly larva at the shop and use a clip 10 and yeah, come fishing and get some some of these roaches. They're quite um, active. You get a lot of them in a short period of time, and you can make some silver out there too. 
I'm hoping to get one of these trophies though. While well, I'm live, so you can see. Anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and also thank you for watching. Okay, guys, I'm back. Damn it, Dave, I didn't even hear you leaving. <laughs> you must make up your mind now if you want to stay or go. Uh, I'm selling. Yeah. Uh, someone just got a keg. Huh? Someone's got a 2.3 kilogram roach here. That's a big one. Like Jeez, man, that, that's huge. Yeah, that will be a global record. That. <laughs> I have to go back and catch another one. Good. You'll catch the biggest one. I didn't yeah, catch it. Yeah, I'm not me, I'll I'm think to go back. I still gotta get mine. I'm just sitting here catching small ones, but it's alright. I'm looking for silver. Ah! Retro, I'm doing something right. Mine came off. <laughs> On the strike. Yes, sir, that was a big one. I've got. I've hooked into a Xander here. Everybody's asking this guy, what size hook do you use? Where are you at? What clip? What bait? Oh, he's just getting spammed. Yeah, I would like to know the size hook that he used. Okay. Oh, yes, I know that's what you used, but that took you eight days. Yes, Dragon, but if you make the hooks bigger, you can catch half as many fishes. And also, you can do the for some odd reason the uh, sizes drop down like to catch smaller fishes in the big damn hook. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking, thinking smaller yeah, hooks. Yeah, yeah, you go to uh, size 2 up, uh, you play a catch a 64 ounce roach. Or a gram roach. Those damn common cops. Be like the hook is yeah. bigger than the, than the fish. And three, uh, five here. Large five, he said. Yeah, five, sure. But then again, if you sit there for two days and you only catch five fish and get one of those. I had a lot of pulls on at some point there, Dragon. I had the uh, large ones and, and yeah, literally I was catching smaller fish. And I wasn't uh, catching trophies and I had to switch back to the uh, side of the game. Did you cry? Did you cry? Did Hey? Sounds like you're. Was it was you crying? Huh. No, I was yawning. Uh, I just thought you crying. You lost a big fish or something. <laughs> yeah, I, no, I caught. I caught a three kg Xander. Yeah, I saw that. No, the only reason he cried was because he's one and that's a big fish in his shop. No, I think he'd be right crying if, if he keep losing a fish and it gets to his boat. No, you lost so many today, it's becoming a habit. Yeah, it's not even like but I'm catching them when it's important. Well, that's when you start catching a fish with a net. Like, nope. No, I think it's perch. When he, uh, when he sees it, he's doing it on perch. He's <laughs> opening up his throat. <laughs> yeah. Because he doesn't see it. I think perch. Yeah, we need you yet, you know. Yeah, so Just feast your eyes on the what? Feast your eyes on this chat right. quickly. Right. Are you ready? Yeah, ready. pull out that bike. Yeah, you're getting big charge now, man. Yeah, no, he's definitely cheating, right? Now. <laughs> Back, so he's got I'm not. <laughs> X-ray. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you guys at? Batoka. Batoka, okay. 
catching the child. Or a goat. This is going happened. pretty good. I got 21 fish though since I got here. That's, I don't know. Um, That's a good bite rate. I have 70. Only 10 minutes. Nineteen. Yeah, you keep them coming, guys. Just keep your line taut. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Maybe I should give it slack. Maybe that's it. I'll drop the drag down completely. The last time I got cheated off, it, it grabbed it, it swam down it for it. I didn't even have the rod out of the holder yet. And, uh, that's nice. mm. Hey, uh, Bob, how's it going? I hear the line checking out this pool. This one might be a focal. Ah, uh, nope. Not too far off from it. Yeah, the people I have on my uh, Discord is, is, my, is the group that I'm with that does fishing as well. They were here yesterday catching their fish and I was busy um, with the family because passing my father on the tent. They we were just out trying to try to forget about it. It's pretty hard. Well, I was out um, yesterday. They were here catching trophies and blue tags and stuff. I'm hoping to find a blue tag while I'm on here. It'll, it'll be pretty nice. Either way, I'm getting good fish here, I think. I'm also trying to get my skill back. It's going pretty damn good. <laughs> that was at 83.2 earlier. So I might get to the um, bait fish here soon. I wish it would grab it. Got every single pole with something on it. There's an 848. Well, anyways, I'll just let you guys know that I'm still here and I'll I'll interact with you guys uh, when I can. Thirty nine. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, these little bastards! They sit there and play and play wow. and play, and they don't grab it. Yeah, that it ain't like that. That's the first bullet in a while. I'm getting to bullet that now. Sitting here watching my poles with the bells ringing, it's like an orchestra. That 
that's why you use the little flashy lights when you don't go mad. <laughs> But then you got the beeping noise, it's on the truck back instead of that. Uh, no. Oh yeah, Didi, look at that picture I put up there with the boat. And you tell me that we were in the corner room compared to that boat, that we were straight for him. Oh, the red lure? <laughs> yes, the red lure. That lure is not red. It's, not <laughs> red. it's pink! <laughs> no, it's not pink. It's not fucking way that pink. That's like pink. hot pink. I... Uh... I know it wasn't red. Here we go, that's a hot pink. Here we go, hot and pink. That is it. Maybe they're rushing the color blind. No, uh, maybe drag it a retro color blind. Or not. Retro I can understand. This gives you follow on a hop of white. Drag it by. They got the right, the color of the boat right, but this is a red lure. They dipped in the wrong pink. <laughs> Oh, it's not supposed to be a red lure, it's a it's pink It's not lure. a bloody pink lure, I'm crying out loud. Look at the pink Quaker, that is a pink lure. That's soft pink. It's a different shade of pink. Oh, I got a runner said, here. I, I think you're sexually frustrated. Oh, then we can do the third I got a nice tench there. Alright, first trophy. There we go. Nice. Yeah, no, the charge is here, people. A lot of red charge coming out. Yep, unfortunately, I've got a feeling we're going to be staying here for the next three to four days. I'll be heading there as soon as I get this this trophy and stuff, and okay. I get my new medal. Yeah, yeah no, take your time, take your time there, uh, with the, I mean, we're still catching them here, and we come here, they're all gonna go, so yeah, take your time. What in your real are you planning on doing? Uh, I think it's going to be the alpha. Oh yes, one, my, one of my favorite drills. I've got two of those. Do I have three? That's I love that Have two of those so I could troll with those. Yeah, they were my trolling reels for a long time until I got the Everest. We're the 1.1 kilogram. 300 kilograms. So close. Good stuff. Now you're making money there. Something on there. Looks like the rain's feet. gone. Uh, shh, keep quiet. You're gonna call it back. <laughs> what you do is check the weather. But yesterday, when me and uh, Ace was here, it showed no rain at all, and it was rain and wind. I mean, wind picked up to ten knots. It weekly. I've tried to float fish. It was funny. No, you know what's the, the stuff of it is it was perfectly sunny, no problems, I was fishing, catching trophy after trophy. DT rocks up there and as soon as he got there, it started pissing rain in like less than five minutes and it just kept on raining and raining all of that time. So I always saw all of these particles the trigger of rain. Have you guys uh, watched uh, Spartacus? Yeah, it's about the uh, gladiators in uh, Rome. It's a really good, good period, so I think it's a few bots of a lot of blood and guts.
Step at 83.9. Almost there. So I think something coming up here. Yeah. yeah, I think Spolik has had like three, three uh, uh, seasons of it. it was, uh, the first one I think was uh, Spolik against the uh, Gods of the Arena. Second one was Blood and Sand and then something like War of the Damned. Okay, guys, so I don't know. Uh, okay, okay, Dino. Goodbye. Alright. Dragon fixing, monkey rolling. Yeah, that freaking jar emptied me. Speak to the jar, I need to buy some coke when I get back to work. the saw team it goes completely quiet. Just a hour. Uh, see witching hour is from twelve to one. Witching hour is from two to four in the morning because we wipe all the bitches when we get drunk at home during that time. <laughs> I got quiet all of a sudden. I got the 39 fish and all of a sudden the fish quit. Did they do that like 2 in the morning? They like, stop by the completely deep until about 4 in the morning. And then there's some days where the entire day just goes dead you don't do anything. And then all of a sudden Pretty much just leadership in the water after I saw five in the game. If you just don't change anything, I'm all out. I'll be like, like <laughs> there's like four. one, two, three, there's four people over level 40 here. No, no, spot. everybody's going for those blues now. I, I should probably be sitting there too. But I so prefer jar fishing over roach fishing. Oh, well, wait, no, this, this, well, this lake's got an infest infestation. Someone's got to exterminate it. The blue ones didn't come out there, I would definitely would know that you and so. I don't know if you want to sit there another three, seven to eight hours to find another blue and then you sit there. Actually, you might have to wait 12 hours this time. Yeah, probably. But yeah, if I took that eight hours and I was fishing on the layer. I would have probably made about two to three days silver, but there I only made about uh, 800, just over 800. Heck, you might unlock an uh achievement for sitting here for 12 hours straight. Yeah, yeah. not for me. <laughs> uh, people dragon and then this, this is the last night I'm sitting here, and then I'm leaving. Blue trophy or the map. <laughs> I know you told me that you're done. He says, "No, nope, I am done. I I logged off off like three hours, and he's still sitting there." <laughs> yep. So that must have been a long yeah. ass day. Yeah, no, but to see, I was about to log off, and then the reporter came on, and we started talking shit. You know, so I just sat there and continued fishing. And then eventually Dragon got there, but then Marina was pulling hands, so I was like, you're actually falling asleep on the map, he will. So did you actually go off for a bit when you said you were going to go off, or did you stay on? Nope, I stayed on straight through. I bet you must have kept saying, this is my last day, this is my last day, and all of a sudden it stretches the fucking five hours. No, it was fine, <laughs> Uh, once the retro came on, it was fine because then literally we had to realize the time because we were literally just sitting there talking shit and having a car. But if I was alone, I would definitely love that. Yeah. So I don't have eight hours to sit behind the game now. 
Here's a question for you guys, since you guys are talking about pink, what color is the moon on here? Uh, I see a, I see a picture of a moon in the light of corner, but there's no moon. I'll see if I can get a screenshot here. Cause this is the best spot you're gonna see a moon. But to me, it, it kind of looks like it's kind of partially pink. Now, Dragon, I think you're gonna have to ask your wife to tell you that this pink referred to one of those. We might need a female to look at it, you know, but they might have a better perspective. I yeah, you must it. remember, I'm in an army, you only get red, blue, green, and black. We don't live in pink and hot pink and soft pink and neutral pink and soft all that black. crap. Pink is pink, red is red, blue is blue, and that's it. I don't tell my soldiers, 